We just can't catch a break. There's always one public figure in the news every week still in the headlines, albeit it could be for dishing out slaps or for being on the receiving end of it. And for the latest one, it could be getting accused of sleeping with your bosses for rules. Early on Tuesday morning, March 22, 2022, a major Twitter beef war ensued after the East investigative journalist David Oinde accused the popular online feminist and producer of the Sex for Grids BBC special Kiki Modi of sleeping with her BBC directors for rules. The entire debacle emanated from the Twitter space discussion Horrible Bosses and Toxic Workplace, a space which generated over 36.8 thousand impressions and tweets was hosted by Kiki Modi. David Oinde, however, wasn't impressed by the controlled narratives pushed by the Twitter space discussion, noting that not a single friend of the house, that is, no known associate of Kiki Modi was crucified, nor called out on the hashtag horrible bosses space, but rather companies like Chi that don't have a strong online presence were the ones thrown under the bus. It was in reaction to the discussions on the platform that David Oinde accused the space host Kiki Modi of owning a sham of a career built entirely on stealing other people's works, while also having an inappropriate relationship with a superior or ill-deserved favors at work. David Oinde even later went on to share documental evidence of the BBC actual having to pay hush money to the real creator of the popular Sex for Great documentary. In his continues to prove that Kiki Modi's entire career is a fraud based on other people's work. However, it is important to note that David Oinde isn't the first journalist to accuse Kiki Modi of sleeping with her superiors at the BBC in a bid to get roles. The controversial veteran journalist Kemi Onunloyo once did too. Do you think Kiki Modi is not really the creator of the Sex for Great BBC special? Yeah.